I just told this guy, it was like, it's not me, dude. I'm a plumber. I don't need plumbing. <laughs> I don't need help on my plumbing. Alright, Ice King versus Havoc. Uh, ooh! Alright, that was clean. That was big clean. <laughs> Alright, so... Ice King, also known as Paul. He he used to be Ganymede, but he recently switched to Luigi. And he has been doing... His Luigi... His Luigi nasty. His Luigi is so crazy. I don't know how he does it. <laughs> I don't know how or when he does it. Oh, he went for the lead. Alright. Um, let's see how this goes because Luigi honestly I feel like Luigi has a really good time in this matchup because Luigi doesn't really sh if Luigi plays it right Luigi doesn't struggle with kill because of the fucking uh, but Havoc's finally starting to set up his traps after getting almost zero death oh the thing about Ice King is he plays for sauce He's he wants that sauce all right, good coverage by Havoc. Uh, going for a roll read. Dude, I, if, if there's one thing I really like about Luigi, it's his crawl. Because his crawl is like, unlike any other. Hmm. So, I'm playing, so, something that Havoc likes to do is... Um, is to put C4 onto his opponent. Oh, that, that sucks. Luigi, if side beam can get stuck on the side of the plat, on the side of the stage, and he just leaves him open to that edge guard. Which kind of, it sucks, but I don't know. It's just one of those things. Ooh! <laughs> if that was a misfire, that would have been totally stopped. All right. Paul is going too much for sauce. But that's okay, because that's kind of just what he wants to do. Give him stage control. Hit him with the fair. Fair does not kill. I'm really surprised that Havoc is living this long. I would have expected at least that back here to kill eventually. And there you go. All right, so you got the you got the stage spike. Let's go. There it is. There is that misfire. <gasps> Two in a row. So for people who don't know. You have a 1 in 10 chance to get something called a misfire. And what it, what it is, is that it just makes Luigi's side be faster and stronger. But it's a 1 in 10 chance. And so, to get 2 in a row, you can do the math. That's pretty good. That's pretty insane luck. See how this next game goes. Paul started really, really strong in that first game, but he just couldn't keep up really the end because Snake set up his walls. And this stage, on paper, is favorable to Luigi since Luigi can come in way better. Ooh, nice read. Luigi can cover, can come on stage, or he can cover most stage by himself, which is a lot better. All right. Ooh, didn't get the spike. Luigi has a good zero. Luigi, I don't know how or why. He has a zero death combo. And it all revolves around that spike. Ooh, getting that roll in rig. Yeah, a lot of people like that. A lot of people like to roll in. It's it's a very common uh, habit. So if anyone's trying to be good, like just start trying to start trying to like read more roll in. Because a lot of care a lot of people uh, kind of autopilot in defense. They either play too defensively, or they just oh my god, and or they don't, just don't know how to get out of just only playing defense. So mix up your roles, everybody, and then also cover rolling because it's very common. A good player will always mix up his roles, and he got a misfire. Get another one. Get another one. Let's go. He needs all right. Save his jump and have it just. Snake with really good recovery can always make it back. Almost always. If not, he could be holding a grenade or C4 himself to get back up on stage. Although he can die from the C4. That was a really good roll in read. 
Hi, Paul. Uh, Paul still technically isn't out because of uh, his his uh, sweet spot up B, which we shot earlier. It kills nasty early. And especially with Luigi, Luigi racks up nasty damage, nasty quick. Like like I was seeing now, with the, just got onto his last stock and Havoc is already tied, almost tied in percents. Not necessarily stocks, but in percents. Alright, big side B. And that's up. <laughs> Alright, we can respect it. Paul, Paul have a clock. Me and other bros, they're having a good time. <laughs> 